Christchurch students have taken their first steps on four new walking trails around the east, a project unique to our city. Here's Chelsea Daniels. Today, Chisnell Wood Intermediate School was the first to use new walking trails, trails that were made for the community's well-being by the community. Four schools in Eastern Christchurch have worked together to create the new walking tracks, bringing a breath of new life to the east. It's been a really creative and new and different project and I think it's been really important. The heart of the project is really about connecting, so reconnecting with the land, reconnecting with the beautiful Otakaro River here and um, connecting up schools, neighbourhoods, community. The walking trails are unique to Christchurch and the students were involved in the development of the project. As far as I know, it's the first created by the schools um, in this way, certainly, and with the community. Littleton has had a map. I don't think there's one currently now. So at the moment, this is the only current living walking map in Christchurch City. 660 Chisnellwood students kicked off the walk this morning, taking the final steps in a project they have been a big part of. The children had a huge part to play, so they've designed the trails, they've decided where the trails are going to go, they've decided what kind of well-being activities to celebrate and, and do along the way to make it more interesting. They've been involved in painting, they've been involved in all sorts of things, at creating the posters for some of them. The initiative is supported by Community Public Health and the All Right campaign, focusing around five key ways that international research says we can all give ourselves a boost. So the five ways to wellbeing are to give, connect, be active, take notice and to keep learning. And with the Our Trails project all of the walks include activities related to those. Um, it's a great practical way for kids to understand how they can make those five ways to wellbeing a part of their everyday lives. There are four main trails which highlight local sites and suggest activities along the way to enhance your wellbeing. And this project is a great opportunity for that, just getting kids out walking, um, seeing more of their community, learning about the history of the place and connecting with their friends and family as well. The AWA trail map, appropriately named after the schools from Aranui, Wainoni and Avondale, can be located online. Chelsea Daniels, CTV News.